Yeah, YouTube fam, Smoke Session fam, what it do, Flight Crew, what's happening? Appreciate y'all tuning back in, man. It's the one y'all been waiting for. We about to go over the first place flower, the first place winner in the High Times Hemp Cup 2020. You know what I'm saying? We did second place yesterday, and it was amazing. It was phenomenal. So I'm going to post right here. This was the top three, first, second, and third place winners in the High Times Hemp Cup 2020. We reviewing the top two. We'll get third place in the mail as soon as we can get that order placed. But we're doing number one and two. We did two yesterday. If you want to see it, go back and check out that last video. We busting out the number one first place winner today. I appreciate y'all for tuning in to my live on IG last night. Not for certain if I'm going to do one tonight or not. We may possibly go live again tonight. It just depends, honestly, on the response uh, from everybody. If y'all want to do one, we might jump and do one tonight as well. Not for certain. Not set in stone just yet. But let's look into this, this first place winner, man. This is what everybody want to see. Because second place was a motherfucker. So I can only imagine how this got to be. And y'all already know, it's coming from Gold Standard. Gold Standard CBD, man. First place, of course, was the Hawaiian Haze. I'm anxious. I'm ready. I want to check it out, man, because I fell in love with something new last night, trying out that second place flower. Um, and, of course, that was from Hometown Hero. That's Zero G. Phenomenal. So let's see what first place talking about. Packaging. Okay. Nice little packaging, you know what I'm saying? Got the little, little, little macaroni in there. Little macaroni, you know. Here's what we looking for. Looks like, what's, what else is in here? Okay, you know, we love stickers. You know, we love stickers. Those will definitely be going in the in the crate. You know what I'm saying? They'll be stuck on there. And I believe we got some paperwork down here. So let's get that paperwork out. Okay, so I think that's everything. So the paperwork that's in here that's included is gonna be your notice to law enforcement. You know what we call this, this is that AKA let my nuts go form right here, a must have. Um, I don't see any COA paperwork. I'm not sure, man, the last several orders I've been getting from different companies, this is like the third different company, I believe, that didn't include that COA paperwork. I'm not sure what that's about, uh, but I'll put the, uh, COA information for the gold standard CBD Hawaiian haze right here. You know what I'm saying? If you need to pause it on that screen, feel free to pause it for the calls. You know what I'm saying? And check out that COA information. All right. Let's jump into the pack. Very nice packaging. You know what I'm saying? Made sure that everything was secure. Nothing was going to break or anything. No smells or anything leak through, leak through. They got that gold seal at the top. This is organically grown hemp flower. We got three and a half of the Hawaiian haze. Of course, I did purchase this uh, myself for the purpose of doing this review and bringing to y'all the first place and second place winners of the Hemp Cup 2020 uh, uh, hosted by, by High Times. So. Feel free. My my cash app is always down in the uh, in the details in the description. So if you ever want to donate to the channel, we're not monetized. You know, feel free. This says proudly grown in Grants Pass, Oregon, slow cured, hand trimmed, third party lab tested. This product is compliant with the Farm Bill Act of 2018. 
All right, and y'all can see the website as well, goldcbd.com. Got your barcode right there. And then you can scan that right there. That'll take you directly to the COA that I just had posted for you all. Of course, it's less than 0.3% Delta 9 THC, which makes it legal. And then we're coming in at 19.75% CBD. So nice percent, you know what I'm saying? And yeah, scan for lab results. All right. Packaging feels really, really, uh, the, the drawer itself, just this label, it's so smooth and it just feels really nice. It feels like something high quality. It's not just something stuck on there. I mean, it is, but it's quality. It's hard to explain without actually having it yourself, feeling it. It's almost got like a really soft silk kind of feel to it for it to be a label stuck on the drawer. It's really nice. And then, of course, you got that. All right, so it's not not childproof, not childproof. But you can kind of hear that as it's opening. It's got the little seal kind of in the top. Smell-wise, instantly, instantly got a smell out of there. Smells good, smells really good. Let me put this back on just to show you all as well. They did put a Boveda pack in the bottom. So you do have your Boveda pack right there. Always good for freshness, you know. Mm, smells good. Got a nice dank smell to it. Buds look really nice. Looks like Hawaiian haze, you know. Um, got that kind of greenish, uh, a lot of purple, kind of orangish red hairs as well. I'll be sure I had good pictures at the beginning of the video for you all, but kind of get you an idea of what that's looking like. So, but it's definitely, definitely some nice flower. You can tell it's been hand trimmed. No big fan leaves or sugar leaves or anything. Nice purple in there. We get all of that out of there. You know what I'm saying? We get all of that out of there. All right, and then just nothing left. Just your little Boveda pack in there. Yeah, really nice flower, man. Really, really nice little buds. <clears throat> nice, nice color to them. I like the purple, you know what I'm saying? Now, in my personal opinion, I will say the um, bud we reviewed yesterday, the second place one of that hometown hero from yesterday, to me, the flower looked a little better. It was a, it was a lighter green. It was a lot more crystal, a lot more trichomes, but this has got a lot more purple to it, of course. It's Hawaiian haze. It looks, looks really nice, for sure. So let's go ahead and start kind of breaking it to them. It's gold standard, so I figure we might as well bust out the gold little mini grinder. You know what I'm saying? Why not, man? We're smoking gold standard. This first place right here. So we're going to check it out. Let's go ahead and break one open and see if we can get some smell off of this. It's got a nice, just Hawaiian, it's got that Hawaiian haze smell. If you're familiar with Hawaiian haze, or it's just a sweet, dank smell. So, yeah, definitely smells nice. Now, with the smaller gold grinder we're using, uh, you are going to probably have to get a couple of different, couple of grind sessions in to get enough to pack in a little cone, a little raw cone, but... I hope y'all got some time, you know. I appreciate you tuning in, for sure. <clears throat> All right. Let's get her done. So, yeah, so far, in my personal opinion, I mean, I'm liking the purple. I'm really liking the purple and the green. It's totally two different looks. Um, but just in my opinion, from the look and even the smell thus far, 
I'm gonna have to give it to, to the hometown hero, Zero G. The smell to me was a little better, it was stronger, it was louder, um, and the flower looked better to me as well. But, you know, we still gotta do the smoke test. That's what's, that's what's most important. And I mean, the effects on that hometown hero were very nice as well, so. Hmm, we'll see. We'll see. It's giving first place a run for his money, though. I can tell you that already. And again, like always, man, I hope y'all uh, y'all are all in good health. I hope your families are all in good health. I hope everybody's doing well in the midst of this pandemic we're experiencing. This, this, this generational once-in-a-lifetime thing we're going through right now. Um, I hope everybody's doing well, you know. And I hope you're getting you one together because y'all know participation is definitely mandatory on my channel, you know. Y'all ain't the flight crew for no reason. Y'all the flight crew because we taking off. We take off together, you know what I'm saying? We go on this flight. We go on this flight together. I tell you what though, this little gold grinder, it get the job done. It grinds really, really nice. It grinds a lot smoother than my larger grinder, uh, for sure. It's just, just, it's just smaller. So you know what I'm saying? You got to take a few little sessions, a few little spins. You know what I mean? But it grinds it up quick, and it's sticky too. We'll do a sticky test on a minute. I'll break off a little piece. Cause you know I got my I got my model buds off to the side for them pictures that y'all saw at the beginning of the video. Alright, so let's let's go ahead and get this dumped out. Oh yeah. That's gonna be definitely enough for us to get to chiefing. Let's do a little sticky test, man. Let's see, what piece do I want to kind of break into? Oh man, I hate to do it, but I gotta do it. Definitely sticky though. I mean, I can feel that. I barely even touched this. I barely even pressed that. If I was to press it a little bit harder like that, it'll probably hold a little longer because it's definitely sticky. Yeah, so not bad, not bad on the sticky, on the hang time test, you know what I'm saying? Definitely got a little, little hang time to it. Impressive, they, they, I mean, both companies packaging was really nice, so I'm not gonna give one or the other the upper. Um, this is just a little more fancier, feels a little more high class uh, than the uh, Home Sound Hero. I'll give them that, you know what I'm saying? But. We not here for just the packaging, you know what I'm saying? We here for that smoke, for that schmino. So let's go ahead and get this mug together. Let's get a little Master Splinter to work. Yeah, so I hope y'all getting y'all one put together, man. Don't have me sitting here smoking by myself. Don't do me like that. Don't do me like that, flight crew. Don't make me smoke by myself. So this got to come out with the taste and, and the effects, man. And it's going to, the other one, the effects kicked in almost instantly with the with the hometown hero. So gold standard, we're going to see what you do, man. You got to come in with some flavor. You know what I'm saying? Y'all got to bring that flavor and the effects going to have to be something special. I got I'm trying to see, you know, y'all first place. It's a, it must have been a reason why High Times gave you first place. So we gonna find out. We are definitely gonna find out today. Yes, sir. 
So yeah, let me know, man, if y'all enjoy the, the 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 lives on IG. If you're not already here, you know what I'm saying. Be sure that you follow your boy up here. You know, go ahead and uh follow me on my IG if you want to tap in on them them Instagram live videos. We went strong for almost three hours yesterday. Um, had a, several people, you know, tapped in, went live with me, you know, tapped in on a video, and uh. I got more people that that's definitely interested. And they said they wanna they wanna tap in on the next live session. So don't be shy, you know. Be ready, cause we be looking for people to tap in, come talk to everybody, you know, smoke some with me, chop it up for a few minutes, and then we move on, let somebody else get a little shine. And just have a nice little quarantine and chill session. You know what I'm saying? That's what it's about, man. We we fellowshipping over here. A lot of laughs, too. You know, if you one of them people, if you too uptight, you don't like laughter, then this ain't, you know, my quarantine and chill session is not for you. Because we going to laugh. We going to kick it. We going to crack jokes. We going to talk some shit. You know what I'm saying? We going to lighten the mood. Let's do a dry pool on this Hawaiian Haze first place winner gold standard. Okay. Getting some nice dank flavor on that pool. Very subtle sweetness with some nice dankness on the pool. Let's smoke, Ken, folk. I'm just trying to take it all in, you know, so give me a moment. Let me get a couple pools out the way before I start trying to give y'all judgments and thoughts, you know what I'm saying? So bear with me for a moment of silence. Just let me get a couple pools. All right, so let's go. Let's let's jump in. Let's start. Let's start. Let's start with some some judgments. Let me get one more. <laughs> Look, throw grab. Not a lot. <coughs> smooth, <coughs> smooth, smoke. <coughs> smooth smoke. <coughs> now. Y'all know I keep it honest, I keep it funky, I keep it real. Hawaiian Hayes gold standard. I'm going to be real with y'all. I'm really not seeing what would cause this to win first place over other flour that I've smoked. I know not every company submitted, you know, or was part of the High Time Temp Cup. But even the second place winner yesterday, um, to me, overall was a better flower. This is nice. Nice packaging, nice labeling, nice drawer, Beveda pack, you know, um, no COA was included. Letter to law enforcement was there. Nice flower, nice trim job, pretty flower. I've seen better. Um, uh, Nice purple color. Looks like your your typical Hawaiian haze. Nothing nothing to really put it above everybody else's Hawaiian haze. I think if they should have they should have done it, if they were gonna do flower, then maybe you should have done the top strains, most popular strains, and then done that. They should have had a category, they should have had a Hawaiian haze and several companies, Suver Haze, several companies, Lifter several companies, you know, something like that, possibly. 
I know it would have took a lot more and I know what we're going through right now. They were just trying to put out some content and still go ahead and carry on with the with the hemp cup. So I understand that as an overall flower, I'm just not seeing or tasting what would make this first place. Taste it tastes like your typical Hawaiian haze to me. Really subtle, kind of sweet, you know, kind of dank, but nothing nothing mind blowing, nothing nothing mind blowing about the flower or the flavor, in my opinion. Um I'm not even getting a lot of flavor. I got more flavor, nicer looking, better smelling flower. I would have to go with the Zero G, the second place winner over this first place winner. We haven't tried third place yet. Um, and we're only basing it off of who was included in it. Um, because if I started including everybody else, maybe I'll do that for a different video at a later date and kind of tell you all halfway through the year who I'm feeling the most. Um, I did cover that last night in my Instagram live video um, <clears throat> because I get asked that all the time, you know, who who I recommend, who I like the most, you know. So feel free. I will definitely tell you, but maybe we'll do a video on that subject as well. But, I mean, I'm not really getting a lot on the effects side as of yet. And it's just a nice, good, smooth Hawaiian haze smoke. Nothing so special. Nothing really setting it apart that will put it at first place over others. You know what I'm saying? Over the competition. <clears throat> now I really want to try third place and see what that was about. So I'll probably try to go back and check them out and maybe put it in an order. Uh, and we'll review the third place winner. You know, it'll probably be next week. Of course, obviously, it's Saturday. So maybe I can place an order and maybe get some shipped out by Monday with them. So we can try out third place. I'm not sure. I got a couple other companies I like to order from. And I'm in the same boat as everybody else. Money's a little tight. Uh, not working at the moment due to what's going on. So I'm in the same boat, but I'm still trying uh, to bring product and quality reviews. Um, so, again, if you would like to support, Cash App is always down below. Um, I appreciate y'all tuning in. As of right now, I'm going to have to, I will change the order. I will put first place between these two. I will put first place to Hometown Hero Zero G, and I'd have to drop these guys down, uh, Gold Standard Hawaiian Haze down to second place, and maybe we'll get third place in and try that, and maybe we can kind of reorder third, second, and first based on the smoke sessions review based on the flight crew review you know what i'm saying if you've tried this feel free to comment down below let me know what you think and as always i appreciate y'all tuning in smoke some bitch <laughs>